Right, hello, I'm Dr. Chaos. Welcome back to Assassin's Creed 3. Where last time I don't trust you. We I know. stormed the fortress. Yet you remain. That I might prove you wrong. It will not happen. So you say. So I know. Now it's time to go after Edward Bridal. Trading posts, yeah, basically they are stored, like... Uh, wait here. A Mohawk man is likely to raise suspicions, if not muskets. This is hardly the first time I've been amongst your people. I can handle myself. <laughs> Doesn't she, like, immediately start a fight? I hope so. Stand being quartered there. The endless crashing of the waves, the sting of the salt in my eyes, and the goddamn gulls shrieking and shitting everywhere. You're sure that's where we're going? Aye. The bulldogs putting together another expedition. That's what they're calling them now. Expeditions. Aye. Smart too. Slap a fancy name on something and all evil is excused. I hear tell the French are readying to move on our positions. Wonder what Braddock intends to do about it. He's already left for the advance camp. I'll wager our little holiday here is just about ended. We'll be marching south before weeks end. Oi! Where are you going, Cully? No, the other cock robin. Well, I, uh, I was leaving. Oh, and now? Well, now, I'm going to feed you your teeth. And you were worried I was going to be the problem? Uh, oh, yeah. And I've had the final hit is just kick him in the nuts. You're hurt. Oh, that's nothing. Here. This should stop the bleeding. That wasn't necessary. But thank you. We should move on. Meet me at Braddock's camp when you're ready. So... This is the Assassin's Creed game, which makes me feel most like, um... Like, the Templars believe what they're doing is right. This is the one that has it as the most obvious, like, thing and they actually you know back up their reasoning and stuff um and some of the things that some of the templar say like they obviously i'm just gonna leave the animus um to so i can read some emails they it does not seem like they actually know what is really going on What are you working on? 
Lots of different stuff. If you're going into the field, we need a way to keep tabs what on you and was stay the in way touch. Her neck Hacking into bent. local security systems won't cut it. Thanks. What are you working on? Lots of different stuff. If you're going into Okay. Upgrade the operating system, targeting and free running improvements. Ah yes. O only one input for interaction with the world. No more choosing between parts of your ancestors' bodies. That that, that that's great. And assassinate by while moving, weather, animals. Yeah, actual fast travel, um, revamping the map. Just temple the fast travel to stations is great. First of all, welcome. So Sean is welcome back. Database it exists. William Miles. Don't get distracted. Don't explore without clearing it with him. Juno appears and just kind of looks around. Hatham's hey, Island, Mila's a piece of Eden. It, it's a key. It's a, it, it's a key. <laughs> uh, he, he's mad that. The, it's the American spellings, which is great. I uh, should fix the um, reply things. You sure about that? I have a, oh, but see, I just manually typed in um, the re reply things. And then this would be the modern day missions, yeah. Okay, back into the Animus. But yeah, so in the previous games, remember when reading the emails, it'll be... a bit of um, the... So it will have it will it will say um, the reply each and every time, which you know, just like four or five. Like remember with the um, so remember for example in Assassin's Creed Two and it's they they're talking about when they're going to um go buy food and it's like hey what do you want and it just that over and over and over again basically um basically kind of solving that So horses have basically no penalty when running through the snow, which is great. So it actually has the buttons instead of head. Use the snowstorm to mask arms, your approach. Head. Having second thoughts? Hardly. But I'll have to approach this carefully. 
Go on then. I'll keep watch from here. Okay, do not kill any guard using a weapon. Hmm. I can hide in that cart. What's in the wagon? I need a full inventory. As you wish. Uh, let's see. Two barrels of salt, 12 pounds of pork, 10 pounds of beef, 7 dozen eggs, 16 wheels of cheese. None of it French, don't worry. Five bottles of whiskey, a couple dozen new uniforms, boots, and leather for patching. Blankets, I like pork feet for horses. What else? That's pork it. Great. That's all there is. I also. Those Except... cannons are like to cause trouble. Perhaps I could sabotage them. So pork roast is great, tastes amazing, I, I, I like it. Um, then... So beef... Those cannons are like to cause trouble. Like, uh, it, it's, I decent, sabotage it's not them. like... Like, I, I... I like beef, yeah. Um, but I generally, I'll, if I have not beef, it's because I'm having Yorkshire puddings. General Braddock refused the offer. There will be no truth. No truth at all. Washington. Yeah, beef generally when having Yorkshire puddings. Those cannons are like to cause trouble. Perhaps I could sabotage them. In all honesty, lamb's kind of like the odd one out type thing. Um, it's not my favourite, I mean I will still eat it. And chicken's kind of a good all round food. Generally prefer crumbed like one of crumb to just the one just one of the skin General Braddock refused the offer. There will be no truce. Why George? What reason did he give? He said a diplomatic solution was no solution at all. That allowing the friends to retreat would only delay an There's merit for those words. As much as I hate to admit it. because the bulldog wanted to prove a point. Where is the general now? Rallying the troops. And then it's on to Fort Duquesne, I assume? Eventually. The March North will surely take time. There's a copy of the plans in the command tent should you wish to review them. At least this will be ended. I know, my friend. I know. <laughs> Like the one in blue is George Washington. So if I did, so obviously killing him would not killing him would not get me synchronization. But 
if I did kill him, wouldn't it, you know, mess up history and all that? I mean, I literally, you literally, but so, for those of you who don't know, this game is like, hey, American Revolution. Um, no, this isn't Hideable Bush. So yes, um, so how would that affect history? <laughs> so I know this has been a really odd episode so far on me, my talking topics. Those cannons are like to cause trouble. Oh, I need to eat. Perhaps up. I could sabotage them. But yeah, the entire reason I, yeah, if I was, um, kind of, I could fit through that gap, crouch and slide through, just naturally, but that's too good for, um, hate them. No truth. So, but the entire reason I started talking about my, um, <laughs> my opinions on various types of meats um, is because of the list of stuff other than the thing. Because, for those of you who don't know, the way you do proper pork for um, proper pork crackle, um, basically the actual roast, then, or just the belly, then oil, then salt. I never put enough salt, it's like an ungodly amount of salt on it. It is great, like actually watching someone do it is awesome. Um, I know, my friend. I know. That map will surely be of use. I need to find it. Those cannons are like to cause trouble. Poor crackle in general. Perhaps is. I could sabotage them. It's great. But proper pork crackle is better than say, like, like which is actually instead of the extremely dried out stuff that I know you can buy. Um, solution was no solution at all that allowing the French to retreat would only delay an inevitable conflict one in which they now have the upper hand there's merit to those words as much as I hate to admit it still can't you see this is unwise it doesn't fit well with me either we're far from home with our forces divided worse I fear Braddock's bloodlust makes them careless it puts the men at risk I'd rather not be delivering grim news to mothers and widows because the bulldog wanted to prove a point 
Where is the general now? Rallying the troops. And then it's on to Fort Duquesne, I assume? Eventually. The march north will surely take time. At least this will be ended soon. I try, John. I know, my friend. I know. That map will surely be of use. I need to find it. Oh, I do want some bucking bottle. So, for those of you who don't know, um, I don't know how global Bucking Ball is. But basically it's a place you can buy. Um, it's just like, hey, you can just buy a roast meal, it's, it's great. Um, it's also known, like, as like proper roast meals, like you... Those cannons are like to cause trouble. Perhaps I could sabotage them. That a diplomatic solution was no solution at all. That allowing the French to retreat would only delay an inevitable conflict. One of which they now have the upper hand. There's merit to those words. As much as I hate to admit it. So can't he see this is unwise? It doesn't fit well with me either. We're far from home with our forces divided. Worse, I fear Braddock's bloodlust makes him careless. It puts them at a yeah, risk. It, um, I'd rather it, not be delivering grim news to mothers and widows because the bulldog wanted to prove a point. Where is the general now? Rallying the troops. And then it's on to Fort Duquesne, I assume? Eventually. The march north will surely take time. There's a copy of the plans in the command tent should you wish to review them. At least this will be ended soon. I try, John. I know. I know. That map will surely be of use. I need to find it. No, I got caught on the ladder. I got, I got caught on the ladder. Those cannons are like to cause trouble. Perhaps I could sabotage them. Now, I want to test something. What it says, don't kill them with a weapon. Then. Okay, yes, this does not count as a weapon. What? Infinite spawning of guards up there?
But yeah, the proper notoriety tutorials comes with um Connor. Okay. With no solution at all. That allowing the French to retreat would only delay an inevitable conflict. One in which they now have the upper hand. There's merit to those words. As much as I think it's unwise. We're far from home with our forces divided. Worse, I fear Braddock's bloodlust makes him careful. It puts them at a risk. I'd rather not be delivering grim news to mothers and widows because the bulldog wanted to prove a point. Where is the general now? Rallying the troops. And then it's on to Fort Duquesne, I assume? Eventually. The march north will surely take time. There's a copy of the plans in the command tent should you wish to review them. At least this will be ended soon. I tried, John. I know, my friend. I know. That map will surely be of use. I need to find it. What map? I now need to get out of here. Which is easier said than done. Oh, that. I have a real craving for pork now. So I should not be doing this on an empty stomach, obviously. Um. What news? Braddock has left to rally his troops. They're marching on Fort Duquesne. It'll be a while yet till they're ready, which gives us time to form a plan. No need. We will ambush him here near the river. Go and gather your allies. I will do the same. I will send word when it is time to strike. Oh, 
all the way back up here. Uh, the annoying thing about this area is there isn't really a um, any fast travel points in the middle of um, this area. Which makes travel a pain. Again, sorry for the hyper fixation on hey, food, <laughs> please. I'll get myself food after. Um the episode. Which, and also, apologies for how long it took me to do that mission. Sorry, but shift and tab is, uh, so shift tab opens the steam, um, thing, so I can't open the map while running, but otherwise it goes, hey, steam, let's do this. Which is a pain. Something else I probably should do, however, uh, seven to three thirty today. Fun and I'm going to make myself breakfast at like five o'clock and hope that I do not get shouted at for it because of how early I mean I'm going to be great go out here try to get myself some food that's all I can just and more cheese or something. Five months later. Yeah, the snow sections aren't ever. The cold, too cold ground. Here, here. Hard at work, I see. How did you? <laughs> it is time. We've set up camp to the north. Meet me there. Gentlemen, let us away. First it was too cold, now it's too goddamn hot. And humid too, as I eat swamp, I tell you. Say nothing of the mosquitoes. Warm weather and bugs are soon to be the least of our worries. What? You mean the bulldog? <laughs> Please. We'll be in that one's beef soon enough and on to the next. Where's your boy Lee gone off to? Returned to finish out his service under Braddock. I imagine the Bulldog's none too pleased after the stunt we pulled. Please to spin a tale of my incompetence and beg forgiveness. He is away with words, especially when it comes to flattery. I expect he'll be welcomed back with open arms. 
which would give us a man inside. Precisely. Unless you've underestimated our enemy. If I have. I see you've been busy. All these men are from many different tribes. United in their desire to see Braddock sent away. The Abenaki, the Lenape, the Shawnee. And you? Who do you stand for? Myself. What would you have me do? Well, you'll help the others to prepare. Follow. They come. Everything all right, sir? Just savoring the moment. No doubt, many wonder why it is we've pushed so far west. These are wild lands as yet untamed and unsettled. But it shall not always be so. In time, our holdings will no longer suffice. And that day is closer than you think. We must ensure our people have ample room to grow and further prosper. Which means we need more land. The French understand this and endeavor to prevent such growth. They skirt around our territory, erecting forts and forging alliances, awaiting the day they might strangle us with the noose they've built. This must not come to pass. We must sever the cord and send them back. This is why we ride, to offer them one last chance. The French will leave, or they will die. So? Now is the time to strike. Wait. To scatter the expedition is not enough. We must ensure that Braddock falls, else he's sure to try again. I'll disguise myself as one of his own and make my way to his side. Your ambush will provide the perfect cover for me to deliver mm. the killing blow. Though that that was a really flickery carriage. We await your signal. There, in front of us. I accidentally stepped out of the um, bush. We await your signal. Okay, so I just have to kill militia two times without triggering open, open combat. Probably going to be allow me to do that Wait, a little bit later, but getting them done now is always going to be the best. There, in front of us. Is always going to be the better choice. signal there in front of us kill them 
So but that was not my fault. But yeah, I know. I think I know how we would have to do it anyway. Wow, pushing me around, huh? Which is a huge convoy. How could anyone call this forest home? The French push back, there'll be a lot of opportunities for us up north. I need one card. Complaining about how people can live out here. Panther, you mean, sir? You are great. Edward. Not so fun on the other end of the barrel, is it? Are you off to it? I'm gonna get this.
Cool. I never took you for a coward, Edward. Come on, then! Such arrogance. I always knew it would be the end of you. Is the end of you. Don't. Hurry before he gets away. I said go! I don't deserve this! You're a hypocrite, Haytham! Being able to shoot him on the back of everyone is great. Why, Haytham? Your death opens a door. It's nothing personal. Well, maybe it is a little personal. Been a pain in my ass, after all. But we are brothers in arms. Once, perhaps. No longer. Do you think I've forgotten what you did? All those innocents slaughtered, and for what? It does not engender peace to cut your way to resolution. Wrong. Whether we applied the sword more liberally and more often, the world would be a better place than it is today. Braddock is not a Templar. In this instance, I concur. He is just an arsehole. Farewell, Edward. Maybe he... Oh no, he was a... Okay, so he is a Templar. It's done. But, you know, Templaring and all that. Now I have upheld my part of the bargain. I expect that you will honor yours. Follow me. And this is where... This is where we we came to. <laughs> so obviously, Haytham. So Haytham is no, no. You seem disappointed. I thought that I held a key that would open something here. This room is all there is. I expected more. What do they mean? It tells the story of Yotzitzizu. Who came into their world and shaped it for what life might come. She had a hard journey, fraught with great loss and peril. But she believed in her children and what they might achieve. And though she is long gone from the physical world, her eyes still watch over us. Her ears still hear our words. Her hands still guide us. And her love still gives us strength. You have shown me great kindness, dear. Thank you. I... I should go.
okay. Um, seems as like the wrong couple more sequences, I guess. But yeah, the p so he was an asshole, but he was also a Templar. So obviously, some Templars are of the "Hey, just kill everyone in our way" mentality, but other Templars are affect more of the assassin mentality. Like, sure they, but so what? Um, so what Haytham believes is ten percent synchronization cool. But yeah, what Haytham believes is basically that so obviously that control is needed, but not to the extent of, hey, murder everyone in our, in our way, um, just murder everyone in between, like some of the other Templars, like, um, Braddock, the dude who just killed. Like, so whereas most Templars have a very, hey, just either they serve us or they die mentality. Haytham is a he's a very assassin view of live and let live, but we would prefer to be in control. But yeah, d discussion for another time. I need food. Goodbye. See you next time.